Sometimes, you don't need the world to believe in you. If you can see glaring mistakes in an industry that everyone else has accepted as the norm, it might just be your calling to delve in without hesitation and rewrite the rules. Easier said than done, of course. It requires an audacious level of courage, self-confidence, and the willingness to challenge the status quo. But that's precisely what Musk did with SpaceX. In the early days of the space industry, the mind-blowing costs associated with rocket launches were taken for granted. It seemed to many that this was just how things worked when it came to rockets. In fact, some agencies seemed to exploit public ignorance, funneling taxpayer money into projects without fully considering alternative, more cost-effective approaches. To add insult to injury, rockets, these marvels of human engineering and innovation, were discarded after a single use, wasting millions, if not billions, of dollars with each launch. Musk, however, saw through this inefficiency. He believed there was a more sustainable, economical way to approach space travel, and he was determined to find it. The idea of reusable rockets, which at the time sounded like a pipe dream to most, became a cornerstone of SpaceX's vision. Fast forward to today and SpaceX is not just competing, but in many ways overshadowing industry veterans who once ridiculed them. They're breaking records with seeming ease, even surpassing their own benchmarks. Just recently, they outdid their previous year's record by accomplishing something truly amazing. Before we dive into that achievement, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more updates on SpaceX's thrilling journey, especially regarding their upcoming Starship rocket. 2023 has been an unparalleled year for SpaceX. Their achievements this year are so monumental that they've surpassed milestones that even the wealthiest nations have struggled to reach. Setting a new all-time record, SpaceX has managed to launch a staggering 77 rockets in just this year alone, and the year isn't even over yet. 72 of these were Falcon 9, 4 were Falcon Heavies, and 1 was the much-anticipated Starship. While this might sound like just numbers to some, it's crucial to emphasize the significance. We're talking about launching rockets here one of the most complex and challenging tasks in any industry. This year's launch frequency builds upon a record-breaking performance in 2022. Last year, the Falcon 9 rocket set a new standard by successfully completing 60 launches within a calendar year. This achievement was momentous for several reasons, not least of which was the fact that it shattered a long-standing record that had been in place for over four decades. The previous record was held by the Soyuz rocket, which conducted 47 launches, 45 of which were successful back in 1979. SpaceX didn't just break the record, they significantly surpassed it, marking yet another milestone in their growing list of achievements. But they didn't just break the launch record. Most recently, SpaceX achieved another significant milestone by reusing a Falcon 9 first stage for an unprecedented 17th time. While it might sound like a routine accomplishment, the gravity of this achievement becomes clearer when you realize that this single booster has journeyed to space and returned safely to Earth 17 times. This isn't just a testament to engineering prowess, it's a game changer in terms of cost efficiency. To put things into perspective, consider the famous NASA rockets like the Space Shuttle, which, although partially reusable, cost an estimated $1.5 billion per launch. On the other hand, a Falcon 9 launch is estimated to cost around $62 million. With that in mind, for the cost of one space shuttle launch, you could roughly launch about 24 Falcon 9 rockets. And with the ability to reuse its first stage multiple times, the effective cost of the Falcon 9 drops even further with each subsequent flight. Over 17 flights, the savings compound significantly. What makes this feat even more remarkable is that SpaceX managed to maintain a perfect safety record over its last 228 launches, dating back to September 2016. This perfect track record isn't just a point of pride, it's a strategic advantage in attracting new contracts. Whether the clients are nations aiming for scientific exploration or companies seeking to deploy satellite constellations, a reliable launch provider is important. In this regard, SpaceX has succeeded in attracting longtime customers away from veteran aerospace companies like Boeing and Russia's Roscosmos. 
This competitive edge in both reliability and innovation has lifted SpaceX to the top of this year's list of the most successful companies in space. Breaking into a field historically dominated by established giants and government agencies, SpaceX's rise to industry leadership in just two decades is nothing short of astounding. Companies like Boeing have been in the aerospace business for over a century, yet SpaceX, a relative newcomer, has not just caught up, but managed to surpass them. After all these achievements, Musk isn't slowing down. SpaceX is on track to launch 100 rockets this year. This means they're aiming to send a rocket to space roughly every three to four days. And the ambitions don't stop there. Next year's goal is to complete 144 missions. To hit the target of 100 launches this year, they'll need to boost their launch rate, moving from one mission every 3.9 days to one almost every 2.8 days. This isn't just about SpaceX's engineering skills. It also showcases their efficiency in operations and logistics. They're setting new standards in the industry, proving that with the right approach and dedication, rapid and consistent space launches are possible. SpaceX's ambitions aren't limited to just the Falcon 9. The company has been heavily investing in their other rockets, notably the Starship and Falcon Heavy. Starship, especially, has been under the spotlight for both its potential. Originally, Starship's second launch was slated to take place between September 8th and 13th. However, due to a licensing denial by the Federal Aviation Administration, the launch was postponed, leading to the de-stacking of the rocket. But now, there are visible signs of progress. One of the final tests before the launch, a wet dress rehearsal, was recently completed at the Starbase site. During this test, both the Starship and its Super Heavy booster were filled with over 10 million pounds of propellant, simulating actual launch conditions. However, before the rocket can take to the skies, there remains one final hurdle, obtaining a launch license from the FAA. There is growing frustration towards the Federal Aviation Administration. The sentiment isn't just felt within SpaceX. The public, too, is becoming increasingly restless with these perceived delays. A top official from SpaceX recently expressed their dismay, saying, It's a shame when our hardware is ready to fly and we're not able to go fly because of regulations or re-review. This sentiment isn't isolated to just the SpaceX staff. Musk himself has not shied away from airing his grievances on this matter. Following the Starship launch in April, he took to Twitter to address the pace at which the U.S. fish and wildlife officials were processing SpaceX's documentation. He quipped, It's crazy that SpaceX can build such a big rocket faster than they can review some papers. And that's all for today's update. If you enjoyed watching and found it useful, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the like button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.